for the White House House Band. All right. My mic is good. I see the producers down there. Thumbs up. Thumbs up. Hey, everybody in the chat. Thanks for stopping by. Let me see if I can get this. Oh, that, uh, that camera's going to make me seasick. That's where we're at. Crazy day. Who is here? There, I, there's Zed, the super, fr- the super fan is here. Hello, Aussie. Man, I put slow mode on, but we're, but we're, we're cooking. Michael, good to see you. Alan Cole, I see you. Michael Miller, AJ, how's it going, buddy? It's going well. Ahmad, good to see you. Tommy's there. Armageddon Nang, hello. So, uh, so uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do the champagne. I think Jenna's probably gonna drink Diet Coke <laughs> from. From her flute, I don't know. I don't know what Victoria's doing, but she she is down there as well. I'm sort of hoping that we can do this three million like during the day at the office, <laughs> but uh, 
This is what it is. At least it's not too late. And as some folks are here, it's the middle of the night. Hey, Michael, good to see you. Bally's there. Hi, Charles Sumner, good to see you. Thank you for all the congratulations. I can't believe that, I can't believe we're even here. It doesn't even make, it, make any sense to me. I still have the screenshot of when the channel went to 25,000 subscribers because I was mind blowing. So, so it's, it's crazy. So I've got, the, I've got the countdown there and it's been going nicely and then every so often I see it actually goes down and it, uh, it hurts my feelings. It hurts my feelings when it goes down. So, uh, so, don't, it, so don't do that if you're in the chat. It's, 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 it's hurtful. 1030 in Oregon, says Bailey. Joseph, hello from Vegas. Good to see you, neighbor. 6.30 a.m. in the U.K., says Sean. Carmen, 12.30 in Chicago. Just a number. I like the way you think. Seamus, thank you for the generous uh, support. I appreciate that. Jesse James, 3 million reasons to stay up. I got you. Rio Dragon, Craig Craig, it certainly is. And we've got, we've got an early call tomorrow because we're shooting... I, I, it's going to sound like a plug, but it's not. We're shooting a commercial for the uh, for the Hecklefish card game. It's going to sound like a plug, but it's not. They're just cool. It's it's just a deck of cards with all the stuff. There, that's Bob Ross, AJ, with all the stuff from the show. That uh, there's Men in Black, me. Uh, there. That you really will only get the jokes if you're a fan of, like, the After Files or you're a hardcore fan. Like, there's the Fear the Crab Cat. No, there's some Mr. Naughties in there. Yeah, there he is. There's Mr. Naughty. So that's the Go Hecklefish card game. So we're shooting that commercial tomorrow. And I'm going to spoil it because there's not that many of us here. It's only 5,000 people here. It's going to be... Hecklefish is a, is a 00 agent, and I'm playing an, an evil villain. And we have a bit of a standoff playing a game of Go Hecklefish. It's a cow being abducted. That's SMK, uh, a.k.a. Rob, the official artist of the Wild Files. Did those cards for us. Did a great job. And um, I hate to plug it, but they're only 15 bucks. Only 15 bucks for those. Are they selling? I'm looking at the girls down there. Is, it, is anyone buying those? Jen says, they, okay. Thumbs up. Uh, what's going on? The uh, tea fetch uh, crab cat is no joke. He's not. His, so the game is basically go fish, but there are two crab cats in there that they really can change the, uh, the flow of the game. You know, like when you're playing Uno and, and you get like the reverse card or the, that draw four? You can give the draw four to someone else, right? Is that how that works? And then they're screwed. So that's Go Hecklefish. And we're working on like a bigger, fancier kind of board game for the Y Files. We're, we're, we're brainstorming it. So we'll look for that sometime uh, in six, six, eight months or so. Gene Lynch from 5,000 on, but only 1.7K. Hit the like button, folks. Come on, hit the like button. I appreciate the, uh, the plug, Gene. And there's Mischief dropping a, dropping a link to the card game. That's cool. Yeah, I wasn't trying to plug merch. That's not why this is here. I just want, I'm, just, I'm just so happy with the cards that I wanted to show you. Except this one. This, this is, that card's stupid. Yeah, it's, you know, you know Bigfoot's stupid. Now where is where is heckle where is Lord there's Scottish Lord Hecklefish that one's funny because he's in a Celt he's in a bit of a Celt I can't find him so those are fun let's go Hecklefish card game not sure it says plug away I appreciate that I'm just excited for them Rammer time congrats agent the Wi-Fi crew to think three million could fill Dodger Stadium fifty three times I hadn't thought of that I hadn't thought of that. It, for our, I, I, one of our, it might have been last week's live stream. I th we had something like sixty thousand people in the uh, in the premiere, and someone in the chat said the Y files fills stadiums. And I was like, wait a second, that's crazy. That's true. That's true. Sixty thousand people is a lot of people. 
What is going on in the Super Chats? There's Scott Jackson. Thank you for the $14.99 Australian. Congrats on 3 mil subs. Wi Files, very well deserved. Most in channel on YouTube. Appreciate that, Scott. Megan asking me how my day was. Hey, my day was fine. My day was fine. We, 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 Mondays are, Mondays are our, like our production meeting day, setting up the week. So it's kind of cool. We get, um, we get pizza for the staff. I mean, today we had not just pizza, but Zeppelis. I don't know who ordered them. One of those two down there ordered them. And it was all I could do to not punch Victoria right in the mouth. I was going to pop her right in the It was Jen. Jen's pointing. It was you. You don't, need, you don't need to taste another backhand woman, do you? She's cackling. She's cackling. I say that because there's a Reddit thread about th that I'm, I'm a, a woman-hating misogynist and that Jen is in, a, in an abusive relationship. I mean, it's, it's annoying slash hilarious. So that's why I make the joke. So they're down there. I'm going to bring them up in just a second. I want to say hi to everybody first. Charles, you need to get some well-deserved rest. Rest is coming, Charles. This week's episode, Thursday, is the first one that I have not edited. So, so the boys, Nate and Josh, have edited this episode. I haven't seen their cut yet. I kind of, I, we need to see the cut. Uh, we need to see that cut tomorrow, just to make sure that it looks Wi Files y. But uh, be, these are two guys that I worked with before as editors, and um, they have a few Emmys between them. So I think we're, I think we're going to be fine. There is Yatokun for 10. I'm, I'm, I have the wrong glasses. I need my orange glasses for this. These are, these are for reading. But this is how all the, the early streams looked. It was just this, my eyeballs. So I'm doing the best I can. 10 Quat Lose for the handsome, logical-looking, fuzzy, fuzzy gentleman with pointed ears that made an appearance at the beginning of the Thanksgiving Day live stream. Who's that? Is he talking about Eric? Does Eric have pointy ears? No. There's Mad Max. Thank you for the 10. Congrats to everyone at the Y Files. Most addictive channel on YouTube. I'm happy to hear that. I, the camera's moving around. Is there anything weird in the kitchen? I, I went through it earlier. Let me turn off this uh, center stage so it stops moving around. I, I went through it earlier. I, I told Jen that uh, people are going to look. So if there's anything weird back there, we've got to get rid of it. You know, if there's any Mr. Naughties about. There's Rawhide Miss Kitty, longtime supporter of the channel. Thank you for the five. Congrats and thanks to the entire Wi Files team here since 200,000 on to 4 million and beyond. Oh, I haven't even been looking at the number in the nines. <whistles> Crazy. Sukhoi's there. Thank you for the 10 Canadian. I usually have my hot wings while watching. That just made my stomach growl. I can skip my 1 a.m. wings, but not my Wi Files. Congrats on 3 mil. Thanks, Sukhoi. Boy. Skipping the wings for this. I don't know if I can do it. Quantum Sledgehammer, longtime supporter, super fan of the Wi Files. So, so, what if I'm accused of drinking the conspiracy Kool Aid? Once you build up a tolerance to the poison, it's actually quite tasty. Congrats on the three mil. Automaton min minions ready to do your bidding. Well, Quantum, I, people who watch this channel are not going to do anyone's bidding. These are all free thinkers here. I think, I think that's one of the reasons why you're here. Don't listen to me. Don't listen to anybody. There's Mike D, longtime supporter. Showed up around 200K. Sounds like I was an early adopter, but I was just part of the tsunami. Congrats. Mike, you, you really were part of the, uh, you really were an early adopter. Because when we hit 200,000, nobody was, nobody was watching the, the channel. All those subs were like kids watching the shorts. So they'd click subscribe. But when, when I was at 200,000 subscribers, the videos were getting on average about 1,500 views. So, um, so if you were here and watching, you were definitely early adopter. Uh, there's Kylo21. Thank you for the support. Bug vs. Windshield. I'm just here to catch some good vibes as we cruise through the universe on this crazy old spaceship we call Earth. It's solar-powered and a couple of lifeboat planets. Cheers. Great comment, Bugs. Thank you for that. Thank you for the support. 947, 948. Cameron Lutz for five, paging Mr. Herman. Paging Mr. Herman. Mr. Herman, you have a telephone call at the front desk. 
That's the little Pee-wee's Big Adventure from Cameron. I appreciate that joke. Dante Rage. Uh, every time I, someone mentions San Antonio, I the stars at night are big and bright. <laughs> Deep in the heart of... You guys remember that? <laughs> um, God rest his soul. Dante Rage 5. How is it that I only just realized the intro song was created just for this channel? Almost like the lizard people <laughs> lied to me. Don't, don't trust the lizard people. Dante, the song, 966, the song is with music on repeat by Victor Lundberg. And there, there are lyrics to that. I mostly just used the instrumental version of it. It's just a, a, a royalty free, not royal, I, I mean, I, I pay for the song. I just thought it was a cool, funky tune to end the show with, uh, something upbeat, because sometimes we do heavy stuff. But a subscriber, someone from the audience, and I have him linked on the channel, recorded his own lyrics, and I thought it was so fantastic, I just started using it. I said, Jen is saying, to Jen, I know, we're down to 20. I, I, it's on the screen, I got it, I got it. So I thought the song was so fantastic, I just started using it, like, sparingly at the end of the episode. But everybody loved it so much, I just kept it there. And now, now we walk around the house going, you know, uh, Camels, lo Gertie loves to dance because she is a camel. 20 subs to go, says Blake. 978, 79. Oh my God! <laughs> well, That's thank you to um, Victoria and Jen. We wouldn't be here without them. Who else is in the chat? Mischief is there. Amazing work on the store. Bramlet is here. That's the hybrid from Discord. You know him as the hybrid. We wouldn't be here <laughs> okay. without his support. I don't know if Paul is out support. there, but he's been a huge supporter of the channel. The mods have been fantastic. Really, the most of the credit for the success of this channel goes to the people around it. I'm just the guy who talks to a fish. Oh. It's this community. That uh, that's amazing. Nine nine two, nine nine five, nine nine six, nine nine seven, nine nine nine. There it is. Oh my god! <laughs> Gino! Gino made it! <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys! Holy moly! There it is. I can't even believe it. Oh, Boy, I when cannot. you get to the age where you need glasses to open champagne. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. AJ, now it's going crazy. We're at 117, 117 after. What's, what, what's going on? Uh, that happened at uh, two. Hey, maybe we hit 4 million during this stream. What do you think? <laughs> oh, there's Gino's there. Is that Gino live from the comedy store? That's amazing. And thank you to the 7,050 people that are watching with us. Oh my gosh, is that how many? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Oh. Can you. Oh, wait. No, I can't unmute you. I haven't had champagne in a long time. Mostly because the hangover suck. <laughs> yeah. Is anyone else drinking by wise lies by Bitcoin? I do, man. I do. <laughs> Bitcoin has been good to this family over the years. Yes, Jenny, you're a fan of crypto? Yep. yep. Amazing. Four mils is Jason Grant. Just Sonic Schwartz, have you thought about looking into the Chris Bledsoe case? I haven't, but if you email me, I'll take a look at it or go to the tips line. And tips. we'll definitely check that out. 
I mean, I'm thinking about doing maybe the searching for Noah's Ark this week. I think that's a good one. I don't know how well it will do, but I like the story. Atomic Punks is uh, Tom Punk, New York City. Congratulations. Thanks, Atomic. Where in New York are you? Uh, Michael Miller's not celebrating with champagne, but he's got a hard Mountain Dew. That'll work. <laughs> 10 minus 9, bought Bitcoin at 1,200. Pretty good. Not as good as us, but pretty good. Gino's there. Uh, that song is so... Store. That song is so dope. Oh, Gina, Gina, so you're at the comedy store? I just see his right. face. Bohemian bees just popped up in the super chats. Uh, Bohemian bees. That's Bohemian the bees. Like, I why the wife house official beekeeper is here. Congrats on the and the million. most amazing and, honey. We got spoiled. And thank you for the honey, Bohemia honey. Uh, bees. If you're it, I mean, the honey's amazing. So check out Bohemia bees. This is our three million shirt. Oh, that's right. And what? Turn it's got around. tour dates on the back. Yeah. yeah, tour dates. I didn't see it in the store. It's there now. Yep. It's there now. I just put the link in. Let me see if I can find it. Wow. Wear me. There it Where is. is. Where? Go up to the very top. You missed um, the big banner. The can slider. I click on the banner? Yep. yep. All right. <laughs> so shopped at the Waffle. $25. Oh, I didn't do that. <laughs> I honestly didn't do that. Twenty-five dollars. What? So, it's, how much is that shirt it's going to it's be? Because written on the front and the back. It's the front and the back. That's why. So it's got to be twenty-five. Yeah, or we pay for it. <laughs> Can we yeah. get it to twenty-two? Uh, I don't think so, but I'll look. You know how I feel about the expensive merch. No, no, I know, I know. but it's front it's and back. Just, when you print a lot on the back, it costs more to do. I got trip. it. I got it. The cards are only fifteen bucks. Yeah. <laughs> and here's how the conversation went. I need them to be fifteen bucks. We can't do it for that. Okay. Goodbye. Wait, 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 wait. Maybe we can figure it out. Do. All right, where are we in the Super Chats? Uh, Logan said that song is so dope. I agree. P-Seeds, thank you for the Super Sticker. I get the merch. But the shirt's really know. nice. I'm wearing it, and it's like not... It's not like... You know, it's some fine. of the shirts that you order are... It's fine. Like super <laughs> thick, and they feel stiff. You know, it's worth like twenty-one dollars, <laughs> maybe twenty-two. We would not charge a dollar over more than you would scrunch your nose. That's at. right. All right, hang on. I'm looking for my. I'm looking for the window. There we go. Is Gino frozen, or is he just? Is that just He's his no pose? Watching. That's Gino. Gino, was there anyone Gino. cool at the uh, performing tonight at the at the store? At the at the store. Can you guys hear me? Is my mic working? You're here. You're here. You're here. Uh, yeah, we had a Matt, Matt Rife show uh, with Adam Ray and Brad Williams. Uh, it was a good time. All right, there's Matt. Very nice comment. Thank you for the Very two. Nice comment. Thank you for the two. Brian McCann is there. Thank you for the super sticker. Flash the peace sign. Gino, Queen Shorty says the echo is insane. I'm not surprised. We're winging it. It was because 
Gino echoed, so I put him on mute. Oh. I can't believe it. There's Judge Judy, big fan. Thanks for all the wonderful videos. You're very welcome, Judge Judy. Your Honor. (laughs) All right. What you're looking at is buying a Mel's Hole shirt. I appreciate that. Um, Let me see if I could find those. Mel. I looked up hole. Are the Mel's hole shirts not up there? Yes, they're they're up there. there. There Actually, there it is. There it is. Now, I mean, Rob does a good job with the art, no question. (laughs) But this one that I designed, um. I don't want to hurt his feelings or make him feel insecure, but. I went oh, to Mel's Although it is one of our best sellers. Sellers. You see that one out in the wild, you know it's a hardcore fan. Okay, where are we? Seamus, wow, $100. Appreciate the support. We couldn't do this without the generous community. We really could not. Any Patreon, any uh, Patreon members here in the chat tonight? Well, I was I thinking about maybe doing too. something just over there, but I wanted to be available for everybody. July twenty sixth. You getting GTA six Hecklefish? We're both getting it as soon as it lands. You kidding? Thank you, Joanna. Good to see you. Barefoot is here. Also, congratulations. Jesse James, three million reasons to stay up. I got you. My goodness, it makes me very gassy. It's still not a professional. <laughs> How surprised are you, Jennifer? Um, I'm not. But I'm super excited. I mean, this has been such a crazy few years and I just I'm so pleased with with everything and so appreciative of of all the people that watch and follow and send amazing comments and amazing crazy gifts and can you say happy birthday to Jim it's his his birthday Jim, happy birthday Bramlett, let's go four million. I don't know. Um, <laughs> I don't know when four million is supposed to hit. Whew. The algorithm is is smiling on us at the moment. It sure is. Sure is. All right, let me get back to the count. Where's that at? Two oh two. Uh, there's Mobile Mandy. Thank you for the two. Kenneth Wilson. Thank you for the four ninety nine. It's crazy because we were supposed to hit three million at like around the twenty seventh of December, which is crazy because that was almost to the year. It was almost a year to the day from when we hit one million last Mm -hmm. December and then it was like okay well no it's going to be more like the 20th then it was like no it's going to be more like the 12th and then this weekend we're like no it's going to be Monday (laughs) so yeah it was crazy we thought we had another month pushing the uh pushing the old stuff happy birthday again Mm -hmm. Jim there's Chelsea K hello from Alaska Good to see you. What 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 time zone is Alaska? <laughs> is that a is that Pacific or is Alaska an hour earlier? I would think they would be earlier, but I don't know. I don't know. 
All right, I'm reading the chat. I have to, I have to be careful because I just want to read it out loud. And sometimes they get in trouble. All those super chats YouTube makes a killing off of, says Balder. Uh, they do. They take about half of it. Look, the best way to support the channel is just become a Patreon member. Even at the $3 level, I'm not going to do a whole pitch for it. But since you're talking about it. Because because when you're a Patreon member, it's like another, it's like more access to the community. You know, because you've got... Disc Discord is free, so there's... How many people are on Discord? 20,000? 34. Jesus. Okay, so there's 34,000 on there. That's free. But with Patreon, we do two live streams a week, and it's not crazy like this. There's usually anywhere between 50, maybe 100, 100 and so people in there. And everyone's camera is on. So... If you want to support the channel, that's the best way to do it because you get you get perks like that. Plus, you get merch that nobody else can get and things. Uh, early access to stuff. Tower of Babel Alaska is in the same time zone as Hawaii. I don't know. I don't know how many hours that is though. Uh, it it's one hour earlier than Pacific. They're actually no. on Alaskan Standard Time. Uh, Billy, Billy TK is clearing it up, saying it's Greenwich Mean Time minus ten. So there we go. Ob Cleared so it up. Obviously, have to. There's mud. All right, I got. It. I got it. There's Kenneth Wilson. I remember when you hit thirty thousand subscribers. Congrats. If I was more prepared, I would have the uh, the screenshots that I took from those days. Twenty five thousand people was so crazy. I remember when we had when we did a. A live premiere when it hit hit fifty people, I couldn't believe it. I remember AJ and I sitting on the floor. I know my voice is echoing. I'm not sure why. Um, we were sitting on the floor in Plano, Texas, watching it turn to a hundred thousand, and we were like dancing. We were so excited. So this is so surreal and amazing. <laughs> I know it's trash, but I can't. It's too. It's first of all, it's unwieldy. And second of all, I'm. I'm it's too. I feel too effeminate. <laughs> I, like I never order a drink up when I'm out, even if it, even if it's supposed to be served that way. Always on the rocks. I'm just I'm not man enough <laughs> to hold that little dainty. Do I, am I lying, Jennifer? Uh, Black Sauce Studio, bring bring out the whiskey. The whiskey was already out before before this started. That's why um. You know when I get home from work, the. Uh, and the whiskey is normally the first stop. So I was telling Jen, like, if this thing hits 3 million at 1 a.m., I'm in trouble because I'm not going to stop. I'm not going to not have a couple of old fashions at the end of a long day. GPRS says, I put a sack on it! <laughs> Great. Bless YouTube, Beck. Kaylin, baby, congratulations. Thank you so much. Von Donks, very funny in the chat. Congrats to 3 million. Do Seth Rich. Email me or uh, put it in the tips line. We'll look into it. Anthony Brownlee asking, have you ever done a video on the Russian sleep experiment? I haven't, mostly because it's so graphic and violent. So I'd be too afraid to get demonetized. Because people ask me all the time, oh, you should do spontaneous human combustion. Oh, I, I did. I have a nice long video on that. You just, good luck finding it. I can't find it on my own <laughs> channel because it just got crushed by the algorithm. So yep. the Russian sleep experiment is crazy how violent it is. But, uh, I, I mean, maybe we can cover that on, on the what files? Is that, uh, it's not really true crime, but. Ought to be. Or maybe we can do a podcast on it. You guys know there's a Wi-Fi podcast, right? I hope people know that because I'm killing myself recording those on the weekends. Oh. This uh, this weekend I recorded. It's about it's over an hour deep dive in the Montauk project. So a lot of stuff that that uh, we didn't cover in the video. 
it was in the podcast. I think this week we're releasing the Silurian Hypothesis long form. Oh, my goodness, that's bubbly. Uh, next week is Montauk Project. Last week was the Grand Canyon, the Egyptians in the Grand Canyon. We, we went deep into that. Social Storytell, where is the podcast? It's, it's everywhere. Spotify, um, Audible, Amazon, Apple. Apple. I mean, I don't want to be a jerk about it, but if you go on Spotify and look at the top 50, you'll find it. Well, I mean, we're charting this week. Jerry and Sherry Barbie says, can I get a shout out, please? With, I don't know what that emoji is, but so many exclamation points, I cannot ignore it. Hi, Jerry and Sherry. There's Winter Roses. Thank you, the five Canadian super sticker. Control, I'll destroy Operation Northwoods. I've covered that a little bit. Um, I, I would like to go into it more detail. It's, I mean, it's basically how an operation, how the, the government, the, our military was going to wage war on, on its own citizens in order to uh, force a war with Cuba. So I would like to cover that. You know what might be a good idea is to mix that, combine that maybe with Operation Mockingbird. This is a great way to, great way to get the men in black knocking on my door. Because Operation Mockingbird was when the CIA placed assets in all major media companies. At one point, they had 12 of the most senior people at the New York Times were CIA assets. So there was over 400 people that we know of in the, in the major media reporting for the CIA. So maybe we can combine that and just make a video about how the, our government screws us. Or how our <laughs> government, how we're the target of our own government. YouTube will probably love that one. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, we shouldn't brainstorm while I'm drinking. <laughs> no, but seriously, that could be a good episode, no? Our, 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 you know, our own government's betrayal. Ooh, I like it. Long episode. Especially during an election year. Mix in a little MK Ultra. Uh, Rollin Poole, do one debunking Tartaria. You got it. That's coming up in the next week or two. Tartaria is on the short list. And um, if you're looking for a debunk, you will be pleased. Wait, this ch chat's going fast, but I saw someone talking about fisting. <laughs> Fine, Fafni, a great episode that will be deleted. Yeah, it probably would. Um, I don't see where the fisting went. Oh, it's there's Tin Man. LOL, as long as it's fistable. All of our products are fistable. Andrew Brooks, Operation Mockingbird, interesting. I've, I mentioned it a little bit during the Crop Circles episode that I don't think it ever ended. And where I'm kind of torn is there are media personalities that are, that are working for the military security state right now. I just don't know how to do the episode and call them out on it because at this point we have a larger audience than they do. MSNBC, CNBC, Fox. So, they'll find out. Yeah. I don't know. Do uh, Romo Rooster do Q and the I can't do anything with Q and on. YouTube hates that. But um, but I do know that that Q watches. Not only do they watch, they buy merch. <laughs> uh, get uh, well, they do. Get South Park involved. I mean, that's good protection. <laughs> All right, Ken Bond says episode on Genghis Khan. Everything found in his tomb in his life. That's a great idea, Ken. So is it Genghis or is it Genghis? Genghis. What? Genghis. Genghis. I thought it was Genghis, but I think it's pronounced Genghis, right? No. Curtis Johnson, I love that you are bigger than the major media. I would call them the legacy media, Curtis. Nobody watches <laughs> the news anymore. I mean, CNBC, I mean, uh, CNN shows get two hundred thousand views. 
<laughs> I mean, it's adorable. <laughs> Uh, Genghis, Jengis, Chungus, Genghis, Chungus. GPR says, AJ, I'm not as thick as I drunk I am. <laughs> Say. Uh, Jen will put out the hook when it's time for us to go. Because she'll sense when I'm going to, when I start to go into the deep water. Uh, yes. Yes. I said I, I, that's why I never stream drinking. Too honest. In vino es veritas, yes? When the wine goes in, the truth comes out. See. Si. One Marcus, get a Rick and Morty cameo. First of all, how? Actually, we probably, no, we can't. We can't. Because when Jen worked for Explosum, Explosum and Justin Roiland were pretty close. So we could have gotten the connection there, but now Justin's thrown off his own show. Has anyone watched the new Rick and Morty? How do the voices sound? Yes. Gino, have you heard the new the new voices? So so? Eh. Uh, I just looked it up. The correct, the correct the correct the correct Mongolian say? pronunciation is Chengiz Han. Right. And you hate it, don't you? <laughs> she hates it. Used to it. Used to it. Um, shunt guy, uh, do y'all have passed? Paul is dead. Was Jim Jones or Manson MK Ultra? I don't know what you're asking, but I've covered the Olive Pass. I think it's one of the best videos on the internet, actually, about the Olive. Um, which I don't say very often because I, I don't think our videos are all that great. Paul is dead. I have covered as well, and I've covered MK Ultra quite a few times. What are you saying, Gino? I'm giving commentary uh, muted, so you guys can't hear me. You're missing out on all the good stuff. But all, all the good stuff. All the good stuff. <laughs> all the good stuff. Um, Sukhoi says the correct pronunciation is Chaka Khan, <laughs> <laughs> which may or may not be true. E, when is the Anunnaki episode? Oh my goodness, it, this comes up at every meeting <sighs> because Anunnaki comes up with everything. So I'm ready to do it. And then we do Gobekli Tepe, and half of that episode is Anunnaki. And then this, what, what did we do just this past week? Looking Glass. Looking glass. Uh, Project Looking Glass had a bunch of Anunnaki stuff in it. Good heavens. And then... Gotta and then, recognize then, the pattern. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. And, then, and now we're looking at um, maybe doing the Book of Enoch combined with Noah's Ark or something like that. The Book of Enoch is essentially the Anunnaki story. Right? That's the uh -huh. uh, the parents of the Nephilim. Mm -hmm. That's Anunnaki. To a show on the Order of the Skull and Bones and Bohemian Grove. Are you kidding? Are you kidding? <laughs> That's like the Bushes and the Clintons with a dash of Obama in there. That's you I'm gonna get whacked. <laughs> I'm going to get whacked. I would never go near a train tracks for any no. reason. <laughs> no, no, no. Don't go near train tracks. And don't hire prostitutes. Matt Brown for two. Love you guys so much. You deserve this. Thanks, Matt. The insult in fact, Bill wearing a blue dress, the infamous blue dress. Yeah, I mean, when you get to that level of politics, it doesn't matter your party. It just... That guy's too that guy's too loud. Wayne Taylor asking for Bob Lazar. The only reason I haven't covered Lazar, Wayne, is because he's been covered so much, and he was on Rogan fairly recently for hours. So I don't know, I, I don't know what I can bring new to that story. Eric Bishop says, eh, agree to disagree on the prostitutes. Fair enough. Yeah. <laughs> Fair enough. Uh, uh, who's that going? Gino. Okay. Butter High, um, Samuel Reynolds, uh, Samuel Raymond Stevenson, 3,300,000. Wow. I'm just scanning the chat. Jared Gibson, Uniparty is 100% right. 
The Universe in Stereo says Fidel Castro's doubles. Um, you might be talking about the Prime Minister of Canada. I'm not sure. Jen's making a face. Trudeau. Castro. I got it. I just... I just... There's a theory about a lot of famous people being doubles. Just, I mean, just Google Castro, Justin it's Trudeau, and just, fine. just, just, just move do on. that. <laughs> just do that. Um, dead, dead, dead runs. What's your sixteen personality type, AJ? Um, what is mine? I th is it INTJ? Is that what I am? Probably. No. Probably. I think that's, that's the antisocial one, right? Yeah. yeah. That's, yeah, so that would be me. There is Zeb, the superfan, Francis. Um, he's one of the people who got us here. YFAM, so proud of y'all. Congrats on 3 mil. I've got you on all my devices. It's like being at the drive-in. Tons of love from the super fan. I think we're going to do at least a, our first, maybe one of our first Y-Cons, our in-person meetings is going to be at the, at the drive-in here in Las Vegas. I think it would be fun. Cheryl Lynn, the Emerald Tablets of Toth. I did a whole episode on that. I thought it was pretty fun. It's wacky. Sputnik knew we'd get to three dollars for Christmas. <laughs> Mark Adventurers, more viewers than Doctor Who. Well, whose fault is that? Chilling at Red for five dollars. Go. Go ahead, Jay. Gino wants to say something, but when you talk, when he talks, it goes crazy. So just goes crazy. Just so I'm just I'm gonna go since my mic isn't uh, isn't working. Uh, just want to say congratulations to everyone. Thank you to all the fans. Also got confirmation tonight from Matt Rifes that he was talking about the Y files on Rogan. Um, we talked about it for a long time tonight. So uh, again, congratulations, guys, and uh, I'm gonna listen instead. Uh, since my mic isn't doing so well there. Well, la last thing though, when is that Rogan episode? Where can we see that? It's been on. Oh. Yeah, Matt Reif was on. You, uh, you talked about our, our the Giants episode uh, when he was. On. Oh yeah, yeah. He, I think he pulled a, um one of the videos up. I think he pulled up the Andrew mm -hmm. Dawson video for that. Yep. Yeah, people say when are you going on Rogan. Well, A of all, we've been on there, me and Gino, and B of all, we're on Rogan all the time. He's always got our videos on the screen. <laughs> <laughs> he just doesn't know it's us. Kimberly Lewis, thank you for the congratulations. She's toasting, so. Shannon Smith, we need the Y files of the movie. I don't know what that would be about. Mm. There'd, be, there'd be a lot of crying and stress. <laughs> uh, Rob Fresh Start Adkins that's the second episode of Rogan the Y Files were mentioned yeah we show up on there I'm pretty sure Jamie's a subscriber because he's because like with the Giants episode you know he was quick on the draw mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. also Reggie Watts Rhett mentioned us and Post Malone was talking about our um, uh, you know mm -hmm. Philosopher's Stone Right, but Post didn't give us any love. Reggie did. Yeah, Reggie so, did, yes. Uh, I do think Jamie's a subscriber now. I, I actually reached out after the Reggie Watts episode. Dylan Moore, how can I work with you guys at the Y Files? Well, step one is be in Las Vegas because we don't do remote. Step two is send in a resume or fill out an app online. Always looking for good people. We brought two people on this week. Uh, Deidre, thank you for the $5. I think Rebecca was in the chat earlier. Is she still here? Yes. yes. Hang on. Let me see. Is she uh, still here? I don't know. She texted me, so she, that might be going to bed at 1030. Yeah, we have an 845 call in the morning, by the way. Do you have to get to bed? Uh, you do soon. I know we've got some super chats to get through. There's XYZ. Lucina, thank you for the $10. Uh, 
There's Chris Nolan, big fan of your movies, $5 Australian. I, I only recently noticed you have Weird Al photos on your board behind you at the Wi-Fi set. So when is his episode coming? I don't know. First of all, I don't know what we do for, like, to, to cover Weird Al. And second of all, it would, I'm such a huge fan. I don't even know. I, it would just be a, here's AJ worshiping Weird Al for a half hour episode. Who wants to watch that? We need to do a Who Files on him and actually get him for an interview. Yes, that would and then be watch crazy. You go, go. Yeah, I would need to wear an adult diaper for me <laughs> meeting him. Check. Check. Yeah, I'm a huge Weird Al fan. Um, I've seen him a dozen times in person going back to 1983 at the bottom line in New York City when he was 21. And look, if you're even a slight... Tiny Weird Al fan, if you've never seen a live show, you need you need to see it. Go. It's so much fun. I was not, and AJ and I have been to three of his shows, and they're, they're amazing. Like, it's, they're really amazing. They're super fun. Um, Ryan Wiley, Gary at Nerdrotic shouted you out the other day. Yeah, Gary watches the channel. I watch Nerdrotic. I'm a fan of Gary's. He's a good dude. We're trying to we're trying to figure out how to how I can get on Forbidden Planet. I just haven't been able to make the schedule work out, but I'm in contact with X Ray Girl about that. Meredith wants to see AJ Starstruck with Weird Al. So that's the thing is I've worked at MTV, VH1 in Hollywood. I've met a zillion celebrities. I have been starstruck a handful of times. One of them was They Might Be Giants, John and John. I never met Weird Al, but if I did, I would it would be an issue. Like I need Jen with me, because I would be, <laughs> qu I'd be, sh I'd be weird. She would have to take over. <laughs> Chopper Dave saw Weird Al open for the Monkees when I was a kid. He was great. Wow. But yeah, I would be starstruck. There's Edward. Thank you for the five dollars. I appreciate that. Pagrad Silverstone for 25. I don't know what the PLN, uh, what are PLNs? I don't know. Let me look it up. She doesn't know. Great show. Love watching and listening to your storytelling. You're great at this. Keep going. I'm going to keep growing. As long as people keep showing up. It's Polish Zloty. Polish, Polish, what are they? Zloty. Z-L-O-T-Y. Zoo Renard, we all have weaknesses, AJ. It's you know, a, a a great man once said, a man has to know his limitations. <laughs> a very wise man once said that. Let's see if anyone in the chat knows who I'm talking about. Weird Al is one of my weaknesses. I have his autograph. I, when we got when we went to see him at the bottom line, everyone got a free coupon to go get Rocky Road at the ice cream parlor across the street. Remember, I love Rocky Road. I love Rocky Road. That was the, that was the tour. So I was like eight, I think it was eighty three. In fact, those that show is on YouTube, and you can hear my Aunt Janine screaming in the crowd. <laughs> it was with I, for any of the, the other olds that are here. That was a show with uh, Doctor Demento. It was a Doctor Demento show. Weird Al was one of the acts. Benny Bell was on that on there as well. I forget who else. But it was a Dr. D show. Make Weird Al a guest character in Hecklefish's Tank. I love it. Outweirding Weird Al would be awkward. Can't outweird him. He's still a great follow on YouTube and uh, elsewhere. Leilani remembers Dr. D. Brother Daniel, I love Dr. Demento. Mm-hmm. Eric Bishop, what were you doing at a concert at three years old? <laughs> I love you, man. I wasn't three, but I was a kid. Jesse, I, I miss Dr. Demento. And what's so weird is when we saw that show, you know, they all look like kind of, you know, adults all look old when you're that age. Dr. Yeah. D at that time was probably 30. He might have been 30 <laughs> years old. Weird Al was 21 or 22. Uh, AJ, you can invite Bob Lazar on your show and do an interview. I could. We're not. We're almost set up for interviews. Um, Cowboy One, Clint Eastwood is correct. 
poor. Ever, a man's got to know his limitations. That was Dirty Harry. You know, we're almost set up for interviews, but we're not quite there yet. But we do have a couple of uh, a new segments for the After Files coming soon, right? The Weird Files, mm-hmm. where the staff will be reviewing videos. Elizabeth McKinnis, Weird Al is so handsome. Okay. Okay. Couch Couch in Amish Paradise, I Wish I Can Live That Life. We leave the Weird Al live show, and I'm hoarse from screaming. <laughs> from just from screaming the biggest ball of twine in Minnesota. I love that one. Just singing Dare, his songs at the top of our lungs. Dare to so be stupid. Fun. Dare to be stupid. I just I'm just screaming them. Yeah, it's a great show. And when he does his Star Wars songs, he brings out a whole, it's like, a, it's a kick line of stormtroopers, right? And they <laughs> yeah. all dance to his Star Wars songs. So That's fun. Awesome. Uh, there's Slav Guns 499. Congrats on the success. Thank you for bringing joy to our lives. You should cover how Gagarin was not the first man in space. Vlad Ilyushin was. I didn't know that, Slav. You have to put that on the tips line. I thought Yuri Gagarin was the first man in space. I, I don't know who that is. But now I'm interested. Because I've been watching For All Mankind a lot, so now so I'm, I'm kind of I'm extra focused on that stuff. You guys watching that? Luke, Luke H., this reminds me of the Yahoo chat days. In what way? I remember those days. Unacceptable views. Yoda is a great Weird Al song. It's, I mean, it was, it's one of the best. Met him in a swamp down in Dagobah. Zach Smith, I got money that says AJ works for S4, and he just does the Y files to keep us in the on the loop and conspiracy. LOL, totally kidding. Love the Y files. You know, I can never admit it if it's true. <laughs> Mystic Merlin Weird Al is a genius, certainly. I mean, Jenny, I remember when when Josh Wolf came in to do his show for us uh, at our studio in Sunset. Mm-hmm. We were talking about, because he had a lot of celebrity guests on. And uh, he asked me, like, who, if there was one celebrity I can get, like, who, and my answer was Weird Al. And Josh yeah. could get anybody. And then the pandemic hit. Yep. <laughs> yep. And then everything fell apart. But out of the ashes rose the Wi Files. Munzee mm-hmm. K for five. Glad I got to finally catch a live screen while it's still going. I wish I could have found the Wi Files sooner, but I have so much to binge watch. Well, better late than never. I'm glad you're here. Jonathan, I remember watching the Amish Paradise music video when I was like seven. LOL. So fire. It was. Love the Wi Files. Um, that that's it. That's his version of Gangsta Paradise from Coolio. So good. Which, which I think is I think that's the cover photo of that album, if I recall. But like, just when you think Weird Al is kind of like losing his edge, he drops a white and nerdy on you, and it's like <laughs> he's back. And then he covers Miley Cyrus with Party in the with a <laughs> she, Party in the USA. He does. Party in the CIA. In the CIA part, yeah. yeah. Drift Speed, I can't believe Coolio copied Weird Al. <laughs> Johnny P, AJ, do you ever get worried about finding a car parked outside your house with two men dressed in all black? Sometimes I do, Johnny. Um, sometimes I do worry about that. But uh, I will not go down without a fight. I'm chunk aluminum foil. Ponyo, I can't say that on the air. Lady Ginger, thank you for the 20. You, uh, thank you guys and congrats. Much love. Appreciate that. Green Monster for 10. Have you ever considered doing an episode about the Nahani Valley? I, ha- I, don't, I don't even know what to do. Email me and, uh, or, and send it to the tips line. Um, we are coming up on an hour. We'll wrap this up in a little bit. Yeah, yeah. Jenny? Yeah. yeah. Because the, uh, the champagne bottle's half empty. Yes, and as I said, Uh-oh. we have an 8.45 call for a shoot in the morning. 
And what is the shoot? We are shooting a commercial for the Go Hecklefish card game. Describe. Cool. Um, it's fantastic. So it's our new game based on Go Fish, but Hecklefish took it and changed it all. And instead of matching four twos or four aces, you match four hecklefish or four cryptids or four government conspiracies. It's a lot of fun. Four AJs. So we are doing a great, like, James Bond uh, spoof. We're basically redoing the, the casino scene from Dr. No. For all, for yeah. you Bond fans, that remember that casino scene from Doctor No, we're almost shot for shot. At least that's the plan. So it's going to be a lot of fun. Alex, thank you for that. Jimmy Hoffa is that point name? I'd like to do Jimmy Hoffa. I'd like to cover that. Mystic Merlin, you're very welcome. The commercial will be on the channel, you guys. Yes. And guitar, Dr. No for the win. You know, and it was frustrating because Nathan's going to do the edit. He's very talented. He's great at everything. So I said, we're going to basically do shot for shot, Dr. No. And he said, I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> James Bond, Dr. No, Sean Connery. He's like, I've never seen a James Bond movie. <laughs> So then we watch the scene. He's like, oh, these look like they might be pretty good. Yeah, they might catch on. <laughs> Car Ram 18, hello from the NYPD detectives. Love the show. Nothing like solving crimes while listening to conspiracy theories. Car Ram 18, let me know where you work. What house are you at? What house are you at? Big shout out for the 4-4 and Midtown South. Tim Ski, 60 bucks. Great show. Thank you for all you do. Appreciate the support. You didn't read the last one. Oh, what do we got? I got Cody Charles, uh, Nahani. What, what did I miss? I, I got to find it now. This one? Yeah. yeah. All right. Hang on. This is a lot of words. No bong. Uh, something with an N. Thank you for the 50. AJ, three and two. Can I have a three way with? Yeah, you can't read that. Next two partner... I can live free or die. I can, that's fine. Grace from New Hampshire. <laughs> Isn't New Hampshire the live free or die? I think so. I'm just reading the chat. The unboiled frog. Very clever. Thank you for the 299. Amanda Jane for 1007 Australian. What does 1007 mean? Congratulations, three mil. Thank, uh, many thanks for Australia to you and your team. Well done on so many eps of intelligent and engaging content. I appreciate that. I'm just checking out the chat. Cards Against Humanity, the Y Files edition, would be a lot of fun. It would, but tell me what you guys think about exploding kittens. Uh, DS, um, my humps plays in the distance. Very funny. Azriel, check back in on the shirts on the store because we have a lot of them now that go up to 5X. The unisex ones. Yeah. The last generation oh, do an episode on the 144,000. I think the last is talking about the number of people that will be spared during Revelation. <laughs> Mm-hmm. If I, I thought it was 140. I mean, I, I think it's 144,000, but I could be wrong. I'm not, but I could be wrong. You rarely are. OG Bean, that's... No, that's... 5X is... 5, 5X is... We look, the bigger, the better. Lady Luck, 144, gang. Uh, Nisa's 144, yeah. Yeah. 
Okay. Yes, we got it. Because it's a gross. It's a gross with three zeros. Easy to remember. So, I, I mean, I'm, I'm probably covering Revelation a little bit this week if we're going to do Noah. Yeah. Yeah. Charles is here. Uh, congrats on three million. Good to see you, Charles. The mods. Our mods are the best. Uh, Congo Red Jr. Cover the Rothschilds. I can't. Not on YouTube. You know, and it's, and it's crazy because most people don't know who the Rothschilds are or why that's a dangerous topic. But YouTube does know. So any video about that that family is... It's, it's crushed. It's got context warnings. The whole thing. I can't cover them. But if you want to know who's in charge... Ivan Tim for 20 Australian. Hey, it's nearly 4 million. Dude! Did you see us just lose a sub there? It's prob They were probably watching this is why. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we got some someone else made up for it. Uh, Giant Keeper Dead Sea Scrolls. We've covered it a little bit. Book of Enoch, I think, would qualify there. So that's coming up very soon. Uh, Doll Click, can we see your pajamas? So I actually put, I put on <laughs> clothes for this because I was in my PJs. I went running up the stairs and Jen's like, what are you doing? I said, I got to put pants on because when I go up to get the champagne, they don't need to see my PJs. I'm in my PJs. But, uh, but they are under the jeans. He had pants on. He just had PJ pants on. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you, Brandon. It's very nice of you. Kyle says, what's going on? I wake up in the middle of the night, 2.30 a.m., and just happen to scroll to this? <laughs> well, this is here to help you fall back asleep, Kyle. That's right. <laughs> 99. Uh, James Tiberius Kirk is here. The crew of the Enterprise and your favorite captain would like to congratulate you, AJ, and your wonderful team on this momentous achievement. Thanks, uh, Cap. I appreciate that. Uh, this week we will be talking about the uh, the partnership that we do have with Paramount on doing a Wi-Fi Star Trek cro crossover merch, right? Yes. So that's crazy. Kyle Dugan, I'm here for Hacklefish. What the heck? Kyle DeGroot, good to see you again. Rodolfo Oliver is there. Appreciate the support. <laughs> Army Nation, longtime supporter of the channel. Congratulations, AJ and team. Hume John in the chat saying, I shaved my legs. We appreciate that. <laughs> we like our fans to be well shorn. The Unboy Frog is back. I made it. And Cody Charles Small for two Canadian. Love the content. Y'all are killing it. Brian Barbie wants the Jersey Devil. <sighs> That's a good freaking cryptids, man. <laughs> Freaking cryptids. He hates them so much. JB Maps, AJ, your team got you to three mil. After Files was slash is an important part of it. I said it right at the top, my brother. No doubt about it. No doubt about it. I'm well aware. Jonathan Bradley, thank you for four pound ninety nine. Love your videos. Here's a small thank you. Every little bit helps. Um, because Victoria has been pushing for a raise, which he's not going to get. UT Tracy for 20. Congratulations. Thank you for that. Well, she married me. Michael Lefevre's for 20, and it's pushing through, baby, just like a hecklefish dump. Live. Way to go, humans. All right. Five more minutes. All right. Five more minutes. <laughs> You know how much damage I can cause in five minutes? Okay, okay. two more minutes. <laughs> Brandon Z, 404, so Brandon Z is not found for $2. What were you doing before the Wi-Fi? I was in congrats. Um, I was working as an editor. I was editing videos, basically, remotely for the most part. Uh, Jen and I ran a studio in L.A. before COVID hit. Oh, we just lost another sub. You see that? <laughs> see that? It hurts. 
we uh, we were running a studio in in, uh, in L.A. on Sunset Boulevard. Then COVID hit, and the business could not survive. Yeah. So we left. And about a year later, the Waffle House was born. Mary Mays, go AJ five minutes. <laughs> Marcus shots for Gertie. Angela, cheers. Cheers to you as well. Hey, I got to head off. Says Munzee. See you. Good night. Have a good evening. Can't wait to watch the commercial. If you haven't done an episode of the Mud Floods, maybe a decent topic. That's coming very soon with Tartaria. Ruby Ashes, thank you for the two Canadian. Mohimi Bees, the official beekeeper of the Y Files. <laughs> Every operation needs a beekeeper. That's right. Look, look, when the solar storm hits and there's nothing left, we're going to be glad mm -hmm. to have a beekeeper. Yep. yep. Okay, really Mohimi good Bees, good you've got bees, I've got ammo, we'll both be fine. Gilda Cod for five. Congrats on the Wi Files team of three million. Are the video streams coming back to Spotify or are they audio only? They're, uh, they're only audio right now, Gil or Gilly, because we moved to a different host. But, but, I, but I do record all the videos for even the long forms on the podcast. Those are video recorded as well. I'm just kind of sitting on them until we know what to do with them. But, but, but they're there. Scuttle Nuts, 77. Oh, damn, he's a fan of Clico. He knows what's up. <laughs> I'm talking about the champ. JTC Gaming, 49.99. Congrats and 3 mil. You guys are amazing. I love your videos. Thanks, JTC. There's Chris for 10. How many of the 3 million subs are secretly lizard people? Probably a third. You need those rowdy, rowdy Piper glasses. To know, you know, yeah, yeah. oh, good heavens, Lamar for five. Now, to get everyone to subscribe to Operation Podcast, yes, look, the shows are really good, and I say that because I don't, I just read the words. Oh, I'm sorry, this is not professional. The boys do the edit, and it's it's theater of the mind, so. The Y Files is kind of goofy, I think, with Hecklefish. The long forms are not like that. It's a longer form story, but it's it's like music and sound effects and all that stuff. They're really good. Yeah. So the like Monday podcast. Trip, yeah. The Monday podcast is an upload of what we did the Thursday before, but the Wednesday podcasts are unique to uh, the podcast platforms. So their original content, their deeper dives on shows that we've done before, or they are new topics that we can't do on YouTube. So it's yes. good. Daniel Clancy, thank you for the three. Congrats on three million. I just lit on up for y'all. Keep it cloudy, brother. Malcolm Archer, you blow my mind. Thank you. You're welcome, Malcolm. Jen said the same thing to me when we first met. I said you could start with my mind and go from there. Hey. <sighs> Phil okay. from MD for two. Love your content. Felt compelled to congratulate. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Iman, I want the facts, not conspiratorial BS. I still get hate in the comments for ruining the stories with all the truth. <laughs> Girly girl two nine six nine thought that was a funny joke. You got one more minute. I do. Uh huh. I can make it. I can make it happen in one. <laughs> I know you can. <laughs> Robert Cannon for twenty. Really love the channel. Looking for the Anunnaki video. That's that's coming soon. This guy looks like Tony Stark. 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 Thanks, Stuart. Thanks to everyone for supporting tonight. You didn't have to do that. This wasn't supposed to be a fundraiser. But I don't mind. It helps. <laughs> um, but I do appreciate it. Eric Bishop, very big supporter of the channel. Congrats on 3 mil. Rewatching season 11 of The X-Files. Nice. And the amount of references to things that that talk of covered are unreal. Fox Mulder would 100% be a blue whale whenever supporter. Congrats on 3 mil. He would. Fox would be into it. And someone said earlier, Art Bell would be proud. There's no bigger compliment. Yeah. 
I think he would be a fan. I'm just scrolling since I only have a few seconds left. Troy White, thank you for that very generous wow. thank tip. You. Stacy Serrano, we are that's having That's my a cousin. Evening. Oh, that's your cousin Stacy? That's cousin Stacy. All right, well, hi, cousin Stacy. Lorianne, congrats, wonderful peeps. You've truly earned the success and it's such an honor to be a tiny part of this wonderful community. You're a bigger part than you know, Lorianne. I appreciate you're out there. Uh, LBC, Clint Eastwood is correct. Scully would be a lurker, says Charles. That's true. That's true. Thank you, AC. Virtually Vinny, there's your shout out. Welcome aboard. This is the Madhouse. Midnight Danger, congratulations on three mil. Let's hope for 10 mil. Yikes. That's not possible. I sincerely thank you for sharing Kenny Beach's story. It's my favorite episode now. You deserve all the game success and, and my money. Also, can we not get more space mysteries like uh, Buddhist Void or keep the great videos uh, coming? Love from India. Thanks, Midnight Danger. Yeah, more um, space stuff is coming. I'd like to do Oumuamua. I just can't figure out an angle. Hmm. Troy White, thank you for the 50. Okay, bro, I just spent $99 in 10, then 29, not 49. I just want to tell you about UFO sighting 39 years ago in Fairhope, Alabama. My teacher saw that the same thing was fired two days later for coming out. Well, email me about that or send it on the tips line. Interesting. Please. Michael, very generous. Congrats. Three million growing. Your work is the best. P.S. Uh, love your Howard the Duck reference. You have a good eye, my friend. Very sharp. Small town girl is there. No matter what time of day, she's in the chat. Very reliable. Yep. Yep. All right, I'm just scanning and FT a hundred dollars. Now I can watch your work for at least a couple of more years without feeling guilty now. <laughs> I always feel a little little guilty. <laughs> <laughs> it's good for the soul. Uh, Envy Circuit Rider, uh, Jeremy, 50. Congrats to the three mil. I'm in Vegas, too, if you need any help. But what do you know about the lost tribes of Israel? Like, where the Celts, one of them, others? I've heard that. There's also the tribe that went to Ethiopia is one of the lost tribes of Israel. I would cover that if I thought people were into it. You know, I don't know about the Celts, but uh, Israelites going down to Ethiopia, there's a lot of evidence for that. All right, we're at 118. I think that'll do her. Yeah, we got to go. We got to go. Thanks to everyone for stopping by tonight. I can't believe we got this far. And I guess we'll see you at the next million? Oh. We'll see you before then. We'll see you on Thursday. The end is near, and so I face the final curtain. My friend, I'll say it clear, I'll state my case, of which I'm certain. I've lived a life that's full. I swam down each, each and every highway And more, much more than this I did it my way I've loved, I've laughed and cried I've had my fill my share of losing and now as tears subside i find it all it's all so amusing do you think i did all that and may i say not in a shy way 
no, not me. I did it my way. For what is a fish? What has he got? If not himself, then he has not to say. Take care of those waitresses, will you? All right, everybody get home safe. This is Hecklefish. And you know what? I did it. My.